Hello everyone, welcome to another Router Gods video. My name is Humphrey Chung. Today we're going to be using a new tablet here. It's the Samsung Galaxy Note 12.2 Pro and we're going to cover MPLS, if I can spell MPLS on this thing, and more specifically how to visualize MPLS label exchanges as it pertains to Layer 3 VPN labels. So I know a lot of people have been studying MPLS out there using whatever books or videos and most of the books, they do a good job, but if it's your first time looking at MPLS, it can get a little confusing. And I'll tell you what I mean here. A lot of the textbooks out there will show you four routers, routers one through four if you're going from left to right. And they talk about well, the first router, it's going to send a packet and it's going to slap on a label. Let's say the label number is 20. 20 flies over here to the second router. That 20 gets popped off and we replace it, we impose another label, let's say the label is 30, that packet goes across, 30 gets nuked, then we put 40, so on and so forth. And that's great, but it doesn't really give you a, a good feel on how, how this works. So a better way, I think, to explain things is imagine yourself going to the local shopping mall, whatever it is, Imagine the biggest shopping mall in your area. In Southern California, we have a shopping mall called Ontario Mills. Just a humongous mall. Inside, it's, it's a big racetrack. Shops are all around. But let's just imagine that you're going to the shopping mall. It's your first time here, and you are very easily lost. And shopping mall has four entrances. And I just put the entrances and exits in the corner, so... One is upper left, two, three, and four. And you enter in the shopping mall at entrance number one. You have no idea where you're going, but you've taken your wife along. And of course, what are you going to do when you first get to the shopping mall? You're probably going to come to a, a kiosk or something, a directory right there. And some of the nicer shopping malls, they have a a directory, a fold-out directory that you can get, right? So if we imagine a, a directory here, it's got all the listings of the stores and locations, and here's the Starbucks, here's the May Company, so on and so forth. As a guy, you may pick this up and never read it because you're a guy. So let's say you're looking for shoes. You have no clue where the shoes are. But walking around the shopping mall, most shopping malls have security guards. Meet a nice security guard over here. That's my horrible drawing of a security guard. Now, keep in mind, you are still in the upper left-hand corner. So you talk to the security guard. You're holding your map, your little directory here. Say, so you know what? I'm looking for some, some shoes. I have no idea where this a shoe store is. I know you probably have a shoe store, but... Where is this thing? So the security guard looks at you and says, oh, okay, yeah, you want to go to a shoe store? Um, yeah, this mall is pretty big. So here's, here's what I'm going to do to help you out. You have your directory right here. On this directory, I'm going to put a little post-it note on it. And if you don't know what a post-it note is, it's those yellow sticky notes. And on this post-it note, I'm just going to write shoe store whatever right so that's where you want to go you want to go to the shoe store imagine that as your vpn label okay now this security guard is like well i can only stay in this little area here i can't really my job is to kind of watch this section can't really walk too far but there's this another security guard over here And of course, you can imagine he has his own little area. I'm going to send you over there towards the other security guard. And I'm going to let that other security guard know that I sent you there. So basically, that security guard at number two knows that the security guard at entrance number one sent him. So how are we going to do this? If you know, We're not going to let the guy borrow a radio. 
We're not going to we're not going to call ahead. What we're going to do is each security guard at this mall has colored post-it notes, business cards, whatever you want to think of. But since we're on the post-it note thing, let's just imagine that the security guard puts another post-it note on top of this shoe one. Kind of overlapping. And let's just say, for simplicity's sake, puts a number one there. Right? So what happens here? You take your directory, you go over, you start walking this way. You get over here to the security guard at number two. You open up your directory, you show him what's what's going on, you show him the post-it notes. He takes a look, he sees that the number one is there. It goes great. That security guard over there in the other corner, he sent you here. I know you're cool. What I'm going to do, I'm going to rip out this post-it note. I'm going to put my own post-it note on there. I'm going to send you on the way to down here. Let's say, let's say the eventual shoe store is actually down here somewhere. So down here, another security guard sees your directory, sees that, yes, indeed, you have got a post-it note on here from security guard number two, takes that post-it note off and sends you on the way. Well, before he sends you on the way, sticks his own post-it note on there, number three. Okay. So what happens when you get to the final destination here? This security guard. Well, he's going to see that you have a post-it note of number three, he's going to take out that post-it note. What is he gonna see under there? He's gonna see the post-it note that says shoe store. And now he knows that, well, we've got the shoe store right in this section. I know exactly where to send you. So in effect, the shoe store that you wanna to go to is your VPN destination. All these security guards are basically routers. You can imagine these guys as routers. And the labels that these routers are putting on and taking off are the ones that these are the post-it notes. Post-it note, security guard one, slapped it on. Once it got to security guard number two, the post-it note for one was taken out. We swapped it. We took out the one and we popped in two. So this is one of the ways I learned MPLS. Is I kind of said, well, okay, we're basically taking directory through the mall, and the security guards are swapping post-it notes on my directory, and then finally at my destination, all the post-it notes are taken off, and the one at the very bottom is my destination. Hopefully it will make sense to you. It really helped me learn MPLS, and I hope that this Samsung Galaxy Note tablet is, will work in the future for our lecture videos and for our theory videos. Please post a comment in the YouTube video below, and I will try responding to it. If this helps you study, if it helps you out in MPLS, definitely let me know. If it doesn't, if I could do something better, I would like to know that as well. Once again, my name is Humphrey Chung with Router Gods. Thanks for watching.